Well, I had an intro plan, but uh, it's ruined now because that thing aggroed me. Anyways, guys, it's King Kunta, and welcome to the video. Today, I got another interesting gold farm for you guys, and we're going to be farming the Black Tabby Cat and also the Buccaneer's Vest. The Black Tabby Cat is currently going for 60k on my server, might be more, might be less on yours, and also the Buccaneer's Vest happens to be going for around 10k each on my server. We are located in the Hills of Brand Foothills in the Eastern Kingdoms, and I will not say Kalamundor, even though you guys like... Oh, I just did it! Did you see that? I literally just did it. The internet tricked me into saying that. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and uh, start explaining the farm. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be killing these little gnolls right here. They're all different types, but they all kind of drop the same loot anyways. Now, the main things we're going for are the Buccaneer's Vest, because uh, that happens to have the highest drop chance, and it also sells for uh, a decent amount. In about an hour of farming, I actually did get the black tabby cat drop, so that actually brought my gold like potential way high. Currently, I'm just stocking animals and stuff right now, I'm waiting to sell them off at a good period. But the drop chance on the black tabby cat is not very high, but that's what makes the price so expensive. So mainly the main thing you're gonna be looking out for is the buccaneer's vest. Now this farm is an instant respawn farm. These mobs will respawn instantly. You do have to kill a certain amount before the instant respawn, it's a forced respawn, nonetheless it is the same. What I recommend doing is getting a monk and setting your ox statue right here and then just waiting. They will instant respawn for you and you'll just have non-stop kills. And especially if you're a monk you'll have that little AoE passive that'll just take anything out and you can literally just leave the game there for hours even. And uh, that's basically all there is to the farm. Now remember, you do want to have a class that's higher mobility. Honestly, you probably shouldn't be doing it with the rogue. Because the rogue is not fast enough. But they are in constant supply. Just set a timer for yourself. Make sure you loot every you know minute and a half for the, all the loot despawns. And you should be good. In uh, about an hour, I actually did make 100k worth of items. Now, that includes the black tabby cat and uh, all the greens I ended up getting. So I got around 30k in greens and I didn't even have the buccaneer's vest drop. So there are some greens that drop off these guys. You can go disenchant them, sell them on the auction house, do whatever you're going to do with them. But uh, either way, I do recommend just trying to get the black tabby cat. This is definitely a farm that I don't see a lot of people doing nowadays. And uh, it's, it's definitely worth it. So if you guys have the time, you guys should come check it out. I've been farming it recently. Maybe you'll see me here if you're on the same server. And uh, I believe that is it for this farm and for the video. And uh, if you guys like this, I'd like to please ask you to like, comment, subscribe. If you didn't like it, uh, tell me you hate me. That works too. Also, I do like to put little hints in my videos sometimes, so if you watch to the end, uh, you're an OG, basically. Also, uh, I actually have been found using a recent method. I don't know if any of you guys are interested in Bitcoin, but if you are in that, I can actually share with you a method that I've been able to mine Bitcoin uh, using about half my CPU. And I'll have a link to the, in the description about how to make around, I'm making around, what, $5 a day just off uh, Bitcoin mining? And that's uh, a real interesting strategy, and I think you guys should check it out. And if you want me to make a video on it, I'm probably going to make it anyways, and you're going to be forced to watch it. But uh, other than that, that's, that's going to be it, guys. I'll see you on the next farm. Bye.